Ooh, what's up guys? Royale with Cheese here and welcome <laughs> to another episode of ARK Survival Evolved from Syntax Cluster Server. How's everybody doing today? I'm having a great day today and we're back here at Bonehenge. That right, I, that's right, I missed Bonehenge. Oh, we're back. God, I love this base. I don't know why. It's just, it's just me. But anyway, also, doesn't it seem like these have like a weird texture? Something wrong with the texture of this building? I don't know. Anyway, uh, so on today's episode, I was talking to my good buddy Syntec, and he had an idea. Actually, it was funny because I was kind of thinking of the same thing uh, because I've been watching a lot of Hermitcraft lately. I've gotten into Minecraft, and they have like this games uh, kind of like carnival area. So I was like, man, that'd be really cool if we had that set up. Uh, but at the same time, Syntac messaged me and said, hey, I'm going to set up a game, uh, perhaps a game area, and, uh, you know, we can have, like, a little game place on the server. And I'm like, that's a great idea. I want to add something to that. So on today's episode, we're going to go over there, and I'm going to try to build a sheep or dodo. We're going to have to, for science it, uh, kind of punting dartboard. That's my idea. I've never made this, so it might be a complete failure. This could be this whole episode could end up with complete failure. I'm gonna I'm gonna warn you guys now. But we're gonna try to make a big board that we kick with tech armor. We kick sheep or dodos towards, and then if you get it in a box, you get a score. That's the that's what I have in my mind. I don't know if that's gonna work. So if you guys like this video, please do me a huge favor and Flex on that like button, yeah! And for more daily video game awesomeness, don't forget to subscribe! Oh, that's the wrong button. So, um, also the Tech ATV, as broken as it is, it also does this. Just, just slides all around. Look at it go. Whee! Keep sliding. See, it, it's, now it's barely moving, but it's been... See, there it goes. What the heck is wrong with that thing? So I've got a bunch of uh, metal walls and metal foundations. We're going to make it out of metal because it shows... Uh, it just shows the color the best. And I'm bringing this wyvern just because he had a lot of weight. So we have to fly over to the green ob. Which way is green ob from here? You can't get there from here. Uh, green ob... Yeah, we're gonna fly all the way to Green Ob. I'm gonna start trying to put this thing together and we'll be right back. Fingers crossed this actually works. And we're back and we're over here at the new um, game area that Syntax set up. It looks really great over here. I'm gonna try not to toot. He's got, this is gonna be uh, something over there. I'm not gonna show any of his stuff or try to spoil as little as possible. So we're gonna just gonna pretend that that stuff's not there. Um, but yeah, so I lined up all, um, where I'm going to try to put my dartboard in line with everything else. We're going to have like a nice organized section over here. Um, which shout out to Syntac for setting that all up. So that was cool. I came over here and he was over here already working on stuff. So I was like, all right, let's go. So, uh, we talked about it and we're going to try to set mine up right here or rather I am. Uh, I think I'm going to, so this is just the starter a uh, height wall. I'm gonna try to pop it up that high. And eventually I'll take these out. I'm thinking, so if I go that high and then the rundown ramp is to here and then there's a little space and then maybe that. So this is how it's gonna be. You'll start here. You'll be like, oh, all right. Here's this dodo uh, sheep, dodo punting game thing. You'll stand here, you'll run. Boom, punt the sheep and ah. Uh, you know, it feels a little too close, to be honest, because it's probably not going to get up high enough, huh? Or maybe that's the maybe the board is too high. I might have to even move it back more than that, huh? I, I don't know how far they're going to fly. We're going to have to probably find a sheep, to be honest. Uh, This is the... I don't suppose there's a sheep over here. I mean, this is green ob area. Um, game, we got any of them there sheep? No, dang it! You know what? I should have tamed some sheep. That would have been, oh, that would have been so smart. All right, I think I'm gonna try to. Uh, oh man, I have to fly all the way home and do that. 
Dang it. Um. Hmm, I really don't know. I should have for science the distance and stuff at my base before I came over here. So I'm not sure what's a good workable distance for for punting of sheep. I feel like if we all right, so say we kick it from here, that's way too close. So maybe we back the ramp up a little bit. All right, hold on. How how quick can we get up to full speed? So if we start here and go boom, probably punt like here. Uh, maybe we'll, all right. So here's the, uh, here's the plan. I think, I think we're going to take this down one layer and try it from there. I mean, I guess we're just going to have to try it and see how it goes. We don't really have a choice in the matter because I don't think anyone has the scientific, uh, studies on exactly how high a sheep tech punting dartboard needs to be. No one's real sure. I'm, I don't know. So. Uh, this is gonna be the plan, I guess. Uh, let's get, so I need these. So we're gonna start, I can use some, um, large walls in this build, but I want to get the different sections painted, uh, certain colors. So I can't use all large walls, and I also want a certain height. So, should be able to do that. And then I'm gonna need another couple rows of uh, small walls here. Hopefully, um, dang, did I bring enough materials even? Whoa, we, whoa, whoa, tech gear, whoa. Whoa, tech, whoa, easy there, tech gear. E easy, buddy, e easy, easy. Dang it, come on. Can we just, can we do a little hover? Can we, can we hover in place? There we go. Can we shift? Can we, can we move? All right, move, hover, place. All right, we're doing it. We're amazing. We're the best wall placers of all time. Oh, look at us go. Oh my God, we're epic. Oh, it's, oh, can we do the whole row? Did we do it? Oh my God, we're amazing. That was great. That was really great placement there. Um, So it'll be one high. So I wanted to make the board. The board is going to be 10 by 10, at least is my idea. All right, let's see if we can do that. We can, can we repeat that with the large walls across the top now? Is that possible? Are we that amazing? Whoa, yeah, maybe not. Okay, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on. All right, uh, oh, we're struggling, we're struggling. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Why am I building like this? What am I doing? Why do I hate myself? All right, here we go. All right, we're doing it. Oh, that's a, oh, geez, please. Why do you push the wrong buttons? Come on. And yeah. Yeah, okay. So that, if my calculations are correct, should be, well, it should be 10 wide and 11 tall because uh, we have the extra wall down here we're gonna take out. Now, if we start, I really, I didn't bring enough stuff, did I? Dang it. I definitely didn't bring enough walls. Ugh, I'm gonna have to go home for more walls. So if we take this out. Oh, and I didn't bring any ceilings. What am I doing with my life? Okay. All right, Chad, I have to run home. We're gonna uh, bring back some sheep, some um, metal walls and ceilings. Oh, I'm so, dang it. I mean, if you guys watch my channel, it probably shouldn't surprise you that I'm not prepared because uh, I'm never prepared. But anyway, we'll be right back. And we're back. I went and tamed up uh, three super low level sheep. I think the highest one was a 60 and like a 20 and like a 30 or something. I don't know. Bunch of just a pack of sheep. I tamed all the three lowest ones. I got some walls and I got some ceilings. So now I believe we should, should be able to finish this. Let's see if we can. Okay. That's not what I want at all. Oh, 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 dude, that was epic. All right, that was really cool building there. All right, let's see if we can, can we, there's no chance we can get in our inventory. Uh, oh, dang it. That would have been cool if I could have gotten my inventory and switched to the ceilings without falling, but it didn't work. Okay, now let's, we're gonna do ceilings across the top here. Whoa, whoa, tech gear, please, relax. Tech gear, tech gear, go home, you're drunk. All right, all right, we're doing it.
Okay. And nailed it. Okay. Now we gotta go up on this side. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I'll, uh, uh. I'm not doing it as good on this side. Oh God, it's all gone. It's all gone wrong. Oh, okay, yeah, that's what I wanted to do. Super jump up to the moon. Yep, mm-hmm. Okay, yep, not bad. Okay, we're doing it. Nice. Nice. And okay, not bad. Okay, now. All right, now this is just the outer box placement. I'm gonna take away those bottom parts. So it's, uh, I think I'm just gonna have it floating. And so there it is. And then we're gonna put a bullseye in the middle. I don't, I have no idea if this is gonna work even. Let's, uh, here, let's put all our stuff over here. Cause I doubt we can ride these sheep to where they need to go. All right, now for science, I don't think that we can punt a sheep that is uh, our pet. I don't think this is gonna work. So I think what we're gonna have to do is tame sheep, unclaim them. Yeah, so he doesn't move. Okay, so it's a bad day for you sheep, I'm sorry. I'm sorry about your luck, sheep. Also, where's the... Uh, what? Wait, what? Oh, there's... A, what the... There was no options there. Okay, so now if we unclaim him, though... Should be able to... Okay, line up our shot, and... Oh, that doesn't work nearly like, oh, he didn't die though. Okay, so maybe he's, hmm, come here. So we need like lower level sheep even. What, is this the highest level one? Yeah, this was, this was the 60. Okay, so we're gonna need lower level sheep. Or I'm not sure if I got up to full speed there either. Man, this is so much science involved in uh, punting sheep for distance and uh, accuracy. What? Give me the option thing, game. What? I'm holding E on them. Thank you. And unclaim. Okay, let's try this again. Let's make sure we get full speed so we get full damage on him. Because I think we're going to need him to die so we actually get the, the, good, the good distance, the good ragdoll on him. I keep missing. Um. Oh, he's not. <laughs> he's super. <laughs> At this point, we're just beating up a sheep. It's not even sheep hunting. We're just beating him up. It's not good. All right. Um. <laughs> he's like. <look>, I. <laughs> This is not, this is not how you should cle t uh, treat your sheep. Kids at home, don't punch your sheep for distance and accuracy. This is. Oh, so he, he went flying under it. Okay, so. I think, I feel like we have to do another test though. Is that just, do I need, I might need to ramp up or something. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, let's try this again. Uh, put him about here. Let's unclaim him. So we might, this, I mean, this is good sciencing. We might have to get some ramps and have like a ramp at the end so that you like, kind of come up to him and give him a little up, uppy, uppy maneuver. Yeah. I don't even know where he went. Did he also go underneath? I did kind of hit him to the side. Did he go in here? Oh, he just died right there. Well, this is awkward. Um, okay. So, uh, last and final sheep. Pay no attention to what happened to the pre two previous sheep before you. This is not, you know, don't, don't worry. 
Like you're fine. You'll be fine. I'm sure. This is mm -hmm. uh, unclaim. It's a good thing it's so easy to tame sheep once you have or you're a veggie cake status. The low level ones anyway. All right, here we go. Um, last for science. All right, they all they go flying underneath. Okay, so we're gonna need some sort of ramping uh, technology. I'm gonna have to. Oh man, what the heck? Why is everything so difficult? Okay, we're gonna eat these sheep bodies, clean up our mess, be responsible server uh, sheep hunters, and I'm gonna have to redesign this a little bit and see if I can get it to function uh, using like a ramp and some sort of uh, system like that. But anyway, after a little bit of redesign, we'll be right back. And we're back and the build is done. And if nothing else, it looks really fun. I'm definitely into it. Oh, I need to get a sign. I need to make a sign. SunTech has signs on all his games. But it looks really fun. Uh, as you can see, there's the dartboard. So you're going to run up. You come back here. You get, you line up your shot. You... Pew, and then you fire a uh, sheep at the board. I did have a successful test. I wish I was recording. Because I don't know if it'll ever happen again, but I uh, I fired him in and I landed in the pink zone. So, but yeah, I just uh, I you know boxed off these sections in the middle, gave it a little paint job. I think it looks really fun. I don't sure how functional it's gonna be. Like, if you could land one in the middle square, that's gonna have to be like uh, a billion points because it's gonna be like really hard, and even to get it on on the board is gonna be kind of tough. But uh, let's get some, oh, I need to make up a sign, and then I need to, oh, you know what would be cool is if I, like, designed a sign and then imported it, imported it, so it was, like, uh, like sheep hunting. Also, we should try with dodos as well. Interesting. All right, uh, so that's the build. I'm going to go grab, now I need a couple dodos and a couple sheep. Um, I don't suppose there's any more sheep around here. I'm going to grab a couple dodos, a couple sheep, and we'll be right back. And we're back. Okay, this could be the last and final test of the sheep dartboard. We have the sheep in place. We have the cheese in place. We've made this super amazing, hopefully fun game. Uh, let's see if we can get the test to actually work. Come on, line up your shot. And here we go. Come on, baby. Uh, oh, he, he lived? Wait, hold on. Why did you live? And why are you fighting me now? Wait, why did you... I guess because I missed him a little bit. Dang it! All right, we're gonna have to try again. We're gonna have to work on uh, like positioning. I'm not sure like where on the board is best position for him and all that. All right, unclaim. Not on the board, on the ramp. Okay, so let's try there. I wasn't up to full speed, I don't think. We probably should come all the way back to here. Get lined up. Perfectly lined up. Everybody, a hush falls over the crowd. The Cinderella story out of Putnam, Connecticut fires his shot. Where'd it go? Oh, he just died on the thing. Dang it. So that happens sometimes. All right. Here, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. All right. Get over here. Back up, sheep. You're our, <laughs> you're our final chance. I'm going to have to get... Uh, we're gonna definitely have to get like uh start breeding like super low level sheep and breed up like an army of like level uh like eighteen sheep. I need to get two eighteens and just breed out a bunch of like super low level sheep. Let's try this again. All right, lined up. Why can't the wheel just give me the options every time? Game, please. All right, come on, baby. So last, this is our last sheep. We're gonna have to go taint, get even more sheep again. I'm sick of getting sheep. Okay, here we go. Come on. Line up your shot. Here we go. Look it! There it goes! Yes! A successful test! <laughs> it works! It does work! Five points! <laughs> I love it! Yay! We got one to actually work! Woohoo! So it's not perfect. It probably could use some more redesign and maybe some work. If you guys have any ideas of how to make this better or make it function better, or if you just think it's uh, fun and you like it, 
do me a huge favor and flex on that like button. <laughs> yeah! And for more daily video game awesomeness, don't forget to subscribe. And if you guys are looking for your own ARC server like the one I use, make sure to check out my Nitrata link down below. They have really great servers and really great prices and excellent customer service. I definitely recommend them if you need your own server. And if you guys haven't come and seen me live, I stream live on Twitch every single day. Lots of ARC and Minecraft and Fortnite. Right now I'm doing a Borderlands playthrough. Actually, I'm completely addicted. I'm pretty sure I've streamed at least 13 hours of Borderlands the last four days in a row. I've just been grinding on that hot grind. And they do this really cool thing called Echo Cast, where the viewers, uh, if you link your Shift account to your Twitch account, you can actually win in-game loot and they send it right to your character. It's really neat. So you should definitely come see me at twitch.tv slash Royale with Cheese TTV. But that's all the time we have. I love you guys. I'll see you guys next time. Cheese and super amazing Ovis dartboard thing out.